Hello everyone, in this tutorial we are going to write a program to ask you two values, uh, values. and uh, we are going to shift the first value with second values times uh, to the left and the last bits at left must appear at right side of uh, the value okay for this we are going to make a bits.c file which includes bits.h header file which is a, uh, our own header file and uh, in that in this file we have declared the function bit write for bit print and bit check and it is here bit print bit print and bit check in this file in bits.c we are going to define uh, bit uh, bit function doesn't return anything and hasn't any parameter we are going to define uh, two float value x and y one unsigned int i and one integer j we are going to ask give me two integers for quit press ctrl c and we are going to read those two values with uh, uh, float format in the address of x and y and we are going to use a implicit conversion of these two values in integers i and j and if x minus i or y minus j are greater than zero it means that we have uh, given uh, decimal value we are going to call to the right function and it is wrong numbers and it calls again bit and it's asked again after two integers if it is correct then we are going to uh, print char bit is is a function char bit a variable char bit which is defined is limits limits dot h and that is because we have include limits dot h and we are going to call to bit print in bit print we are going to call bit print of i which is the first variable and we are going to define uh, three integer k n m n is size of i multiple by char bit and m equal one shifted n minus one times n minus one times and for k from one to n less than or equal n we are going to use put char i and m if i and m equal zero then put it zero otherwise put it one and we are going to shift i with one to the left with one and put it in i if k reminded by char bit equals zero and k less than n then put char a, a, a free space 
and then we are going to uh, use the stars and after we are finished we are coming here and we call beat shake I and J in beat shake we are going to define three variables integer k and m and n is size of i multiple by char bit m is 1 with n minus 1 times uh, shifted to the left and for integer i i i from 1 less than equal n and k from 1 less than equal j if i and m is 0 i must be shifted one time otherwise i must be shifted one time and you are going to make or between i and 1 and put it in i and then you are going to call pr beat print and we are going to print the uh, variable until it is uh, it is uh, finished okay now we are going to and in uh, main we are going to call beat only beat function we are going to run this And I have a nineteen and three. And the values you can see here. This is a nineteen, and we are shifting three times. Three, one, two, three. It is this, and what is here appeared there and again three times it was here one two three and it is here and three of these coming here again three times one two three here 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 and it is again up here one two three here one two three here one two three here and so down until you have reached the same value 19 it continues it continues until you are going to get the value 19 here and stop it okay it was all in this tutorial see you on next tutorial